Thousands of freight workers are now looking to their next steps following Yellow Corporation's announcement that it would be shutting down almost two weeks ago. Yeah, TV6's Hernan Gutierrez heard from the union that represents them in the Quad Cities and is organizing resources to help them find their next job. Hernan? Teamsters Local 371 hosted a handful of job-related organizations and community colleges today at two meetings to help transition its members after Yellow's closure. They represent about 90 workers out of Rock Island. One union member I spoke to says it was a great resource to get back on his feet. It's just sad for the area to lose 90, 90 really good jobs. Teamsters member David Jost worked at Yellow's Rock Island Terminal driving trucks and helping the loading docks for 25 years. He says while there were rumblings of layoffs coming, the closure came as a shock. Like 30 people were laid off and we're like, this isn't good. And then all of a sudden came down that we stopped functioning as a trucking company. We just delivered what was there. We didn't pick up anything more. Local 371 hosted two meetings to get resources to their members on Thursday. The U.S. Department of Labor, state employment agencies, and the American Job Center were all brought in to talk to union workers about their retirement, health care, and filing for unemployment. So that'll be the next step for them. Others are already applying and looking for work in order to replace. Um, there are some of the fields for people that they've lost their job here, but they're very marketable. The union's president says some of his members haven't been in this position for 30 or 40 years. They have never filed for unemployment. They've never had to look for a job. Never planned to, so we're getting them into the, the new system and, and helping them with getting out there. Jost is hoping to hop into retirement early or maybe find a part-time job. I uh, am very fortunate compared to some of the people that I'm able to reach out and get into my retirement uh, where other guys who aren't old enough are stuck trying to find a job and trying to find another good union job around the area is not easy. The Teamsters represented about 22,000 Yellow employees nationwide. The company filed for bankruptcy on Sunday. All right, Renan, thank you. Now, Yellow Corporation was based out of Nashville.